Okay, we're back in part two for the inside of 2005 Subaru. And to me, it looks like it's brand new because my <laughs> nephew takes care of it so well. Yeah. Okay, um, what's going on here? In the so back? One, of the, one of the biggest things, I mean, mind my, my school stuff and blankets, but uh, one of the biggest things that I really like about this car is the space. Um, yeah. And, and the cool thing is, I mean, you can have it like a regular trunk. Um, and, and so I have this space here. And it's cool because in this car, actually, say you have uh, some expensive things back here or something like that, or, or maybe like tools or something that you don't want people seeing through the windows. Let's you see how that cover works. You, yeah. you can actually pull this back. Oh, nice. And it latches. And so then when you close the trunk, you can't see anything under there. No, this is just a canvas? Yeah. Okay. That's yeah. nice. It's pretty uh, durable here. Yeah. And it's nice because it helps keep the, the sun and the heat off the things, too. Okay. So, uh, I mean, if you had like, I don't know, some, some chocolate cookies or something in the back and it's real sunny out, if, if you put this over, it helps definitely keep the, the heat and the sun from melting the chocolate and stuff like that. Wonderful. But, uh, but the other thing about this car, though, is if this isn't enough space for you, um, you can stand there and I'll show you. All right. I'm just going to put the seats down now. That's just one seat. Um, but I mean, I mean, both of those seats fold, fold down flat. And so it, it makes that room, I mean, yeah. twice as big. And that, that bar, that cover actually comes off too. Now, is, is that like a, a five foot clearance from the back? I don't know. To the back? I, I don't know the exact clearance, but okay. I'd say five feet or maybe a little more. All right. So I, I can, me and my friend can actually like lay down as if we were to sleep in there. Or you can have a tailgate party. Oh, in this yeah. Car. <laughs> oh, yeah. But it's it's nice to it's nice to have um, a station wagon um, because you can you well, know put all the seats down. You can put a lot of things your luggage in here. You can put um, coolers in there. Um, there's a lot of whatever. storage too. I mean even even down here on the sides on each side there's there's this little compartment and it has a little cigarette lighter so you can plug in a air compressor or or the, the, one of those vacuums too. Yeah, right? something like that. Okay. Um, and then under all this. There's also storage under here, and th this is where oh nice this is where I keep a lot of my my like important stuff. I always keep a fire extinguisher because yeah that that's a must. I always have a uh, fire you, extinguisher. You never and know some tools with you. Some, I have this full of tools, so okay, good job. Um, now this is a military. This yeah, these military things. Yeah, well, or they can't. I think they carried like ammo in there. Yeah, I like okay. it because it's it's actually waterproof. But I mean, right. I, I can pull it out real quick. It has okay. a lot of a lot of just basic things i mean little things that you never know if you'll need i mean tape yeah towels if if you spill something or yeah. something yeah little screwdrivers okay knives markers flashlights all, all those things now this is one of these tools it's a universal tool you can put any kind of a fitting yeah, on it you can use screwdrivers uh, all right allen wrenches or whatever you need okay but i i put i put a lot of just multi-tool type things in there because sometimes if you're on your own you, you never know if you're going to need it that's really nice. I like that. So, always I always stay prepared, you know. Yeah, um, you have to. And then and then that's not all actually. Under all of this, if I can grip it, the spare tire is actually up under there. Now, is is this a regular tire or a donut? Yeah, it's a donut. Oh, okay. And, and then I, I have jumper cables under there too. Now you can only drive about 30 40 minutes on it. Yeah, you can. Well, and all the, on these cars actually, you have to be careful because of the way that the all-wheel drive works. If you have a donut on one side, it's going to be smaller than the, the tire on the other side. Yeah. And if you drive too long like that, uh, the, the car actually thinks you're turning because one diameter is bigger than the other. And, and it's it's a little hard to explain, but since one wheel's smaller, one's bigger, the, the car feels like it's turning. And over right. time, if you keep driving, the, the transmission and the, uh, yeah. the parts in there start to start to tear down. It'll put stress on it, yeah, and probably the suspension too. Yeah, well, and also, also the... Spare tires aren't aren't as strong. Oh, uh, okay, so, okay. But uh, but yeah, that that's the back. No, um, well, you said you take premium gas. I do, and that's because it's turbocharged, so it. We'll it see takes what the, the seats. No, are these leather seats? Yeah. Okay, and, and it looks like they're really clean here. Oh yeah. And uh, it's spacious. Oh yeah. And uh, what's the fuel economy on it, Jacob? I average eighteen miles per gallon right now. And that, that's a mix of city and highway driving. I've gotten it up to about 23 miles per gallon highway, which isn't bad for the car, but um, it's not bad. It has a fairly okay. big gas tank, so I mean, it, it can go for a while. Okay, that's the front there. Yep. 
power seats on both sides, and they're both heated. That's nice to have power seats and, and heated on, on the driver's side because a lot of cars don't have that. Yeah. Um, and this is a 05, so. And that wood in there, I, I, I actually put that in myself. Which one? Which Those wood yeah, pieces. That yeah, we, I'll see if I can get on the other side of you, show. Y'all coming around on the other side? Yeah. But yeah, these these wood here, uh -huh. they used to be this same silver, uh, and these these came from a, a different uh, version of this car, and I found them actually on eBay. Some guy was selling them. And oh I, really? I like the wood look. I like it better too. I think it looks more classier. So, and, and then this this thing I actually got at a Walmart. This little cover, it was like ten bucks, but I kind of like it because uh -huh. it's, it's kind of comfortable. Yeah, it has uh, the little like the wood grain here too. But I've seen them where they have wood grain here on this side and the other yeah. side. Or the whole thing will be like it. And then something interesting about this car, there, there's a plus and a minus here on the steering wheel. It's on both sides. And a lot of cars have controls for your radio. Well, this is not controls for your radio. Okay. This, I'm obviously not going to go anywhere, but I can I can shift it down into drive, which is regular drive. But I can also push it over, and that puts you in sport mode. Oh. And there's a plus and a minus here, so you can actually go down a gear. Okay. Or you can go up a gear. Gotcha. And this plus and minus does the same thing. You can go up a gear or you can go down. And actually, I don't know if you can see it, there's a number here on this, on the gauges. And every time I, uh, every time I shift, it actually will go up. I see it, and yeah. And since we're parked, it, it won't let me go up to three, four, or five. There's five, right, five gears. Right, you're not driving it. Uh-huh. But, uh, this, this car, you can actually start it in second gear. So oh, really? if you're in snow or something like that, you, you can start in second gear and it helps keep you from spitting tires and things like that. Okay, what what's up here? Is this like a... That's just storage. Oh, okay. You put your sunglasses there or whatever. The higher ver uh, the upper model of this car actually had a, a screen, a navigation. Oh, right really? There. So 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 you changed this out? No, this, this car actually had this because this car is not the highest trim. There's okay. There's one more higher. Okay. But uh, So this one came with the pocket here, but the next level up had a screen here. Okay. Uh, and I want to do some modification of the radio so I can use my, my phone on it, but I have to get a, a kit from the higher end of the car too because these air conditioning controls are together with the, the radio, and right. so I would have to replace it all as, as one thing. Mm -hmm. um, and it's a little bit expensive to do that, but eventually I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go ahead and do that. Okay. And AC, AC run, runs good. And, oh, uh, yeah. Heat and air conditioning. Heat air conditioning runs good. Okay. Um, this this right here, this little dial. What is this for? Left and right. These are heated seats. So. Oh, that's the heated seat control. Yep. Okay. And there's there's like four or five different stages. So like right now, my side is off, uh, and I mean you can. Uh, that's fully, fully hot. Okay. You know you can do the middle, and it's the same for both sides. So and it's nice because it's right there where you. Can, it is. You can reach. And it. and now he added some some blue lights down here. Those actually can change. Oh, okay. I'm going to keep this down here and he's going to change them. Yeah, we're up to 8 minutes. Or, uh, yeah. 8.15. I mean, we can leave 10 minute video. Uh, it actually it actually operates on my phone. And so I, I can change it to a, a darker blue. Um, I, can do, I can do any color, but right now I have one set. And I can do a, a red, a purple. That's nice. Green. Or what I like is the white. If you lose, oh. if you lose something, you turn the it's white. It's pretty bright, yeah. And you can find anything you lose. Mhm. Mm but uh, and then obviously you you can make it blink and glow, and you can actually make it go to music and things like that. <laughs> oh, that's but neat. I didn't know it, that. It is neat. Um, I, I usually just leave it as one, but uh. What? Where did you purchase this, purchase it at? That and... I, I got at AutoZone actually. AutoZone. Uh, okay. Yeah. It was like thirty dollars. I mean, it's it's kind of expensive, but it's just because it runs from the phone. And yeah, so that's I, not too bad. I now, have a special. Now, little, do you have to upload like an app to control it, right? Yeah, yeah. There's an app. Okay. But uh, I have a little pocket which you, you can't see, but it's a little, it's a little kind of a gateway to get in your like fuse box and things. Right. And I actually have the the master controller in there, so I can press a button and it actually turns them off. So, because some, sometimes when it's dark, it gets distracted. And that's your emergency brake here. Yep. And uh, center console. Um, mm -hmm. You got two places to put your drinks. And this thing actually, uh, you can, it comes up a little bit. Oh, that's probably for like a, oh, okay. And then you can actually open it too. Oh, okay. So. Yeah, you can put your change or whatever in there. So. Yep. <laughs> okay, we're going to wish everybody a happy Thanksgiving.